this video shows you how you can upgrade your battery icon in Windows 11, making it easier to see how much you've got left and adding more features. If you're watching this video as a short, tap on the thumbnail in the bottom right hand corner to see the full video. If you're already watching the full video, hang tight, more details coming up shortly. As you can see on the Windows 11 battery meter, it's pretty non-eventful but you can uprate it, you can upgrade it for free. All you need to do is click on the start button just there and then type on your keyboard the word store. After a few seconds, under best match, you should see Microsoft Store app. Move your mouse over that, left click once, then once the Microsoft Store is loaded, it might ask you to sign in. It's up to you if you want to sign in or not. Mine's not asked me and I'm not going to bother signing in. So all I'm going to do is I'm just going to move my mouse up to search apps, games, movies and more. Left click once in that box there and then just type battery tracker. And then hopefully after a few seconds, you should see battery tracker app and this same icon, the battery with the exclamation mark in it. Move your mouse over that, left click once. And then hopefully you should now see this. And on the left there, you should see a blue get button just below battery tracker my fix 16. Move your mouse over get, left click once. Now, this will now download and install the Battery Tracker app. It might take a bit of time. It really does depend on the speed of your internet connection. As you can see, mine started downloading and hopefully shouldn't take too long. There we go. It's now downloaded and it's now installing. Once it's installed, click on Open. And if like me, it looks like nothing's happened, just have a look down by the clock in the bottom right hand corner of the screen and see if you can see some numbers. If you can't, like I can't, click on the arrow pointing upwards and there you go, there's a set of numbers there. And that is the percentage of battery I've got left. Now, obviously at the moment where it is, it's hidden and it's pretty useless where it is at the moment. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna show you how you can move that so it's visible all the time on the taskbar. So just move your mouse anywhere along a spare part of the taskbar. I'm just gonna move mine over here. Click on the right mouse button. That's the button on the right hand side of the mouse, not the left. Once you've clicked the right hand mouse button, you should see taskbar settings appear somewhere near the mouse icon. Once you see that, move your mouse over it, click the left mouse button, and then this should appear. Scroll down until you get to taskbar corner overflow. Move your mouse over that, left click once, and then scroll down and you're looking for battery tracker. And you'll probably find like mine just to the right of it, it says it's off. So switch that on just by clicking on the little toggle switch beside it. And there you go, now you'll see there's the percentage of battery I've got left appears in the taskbar at the bottom of the screen. So let's close down this personalization taskbar box here and we can close down the Windows Store as well. We've finished with that, so just close that down. So let's have a look in greater detail about this app. So let's just move our mouse over the percentage there, the numbers, click on the right mouse button. That's the button on the right hand side of the mouse, not the left. Then move your mouse over settings, left click once, and here we are. So we've got a few things here we've uh, as extras. We've got enable fully charged notification. Now with that switched on, it means once the battery is fully charged, I will get a notification in the bottom right hand corner of the screen to let me know it's fully charged. I know some people don't like leaving their laptop plugged into the mains after the battery's fully charged. So it's it's great, it will let you know and you can obviously unplug it if you want. Me, I keep my laptop plugged in at all times when I, I can. Battery technology is much better now than it ever used to be. It used to be the case of if you left your if you left your uh, laptop plugged in at the mains and you overcharge the battery, you could risk damaging it. But nowadays, I really don't think there's that fear. You've also got enable low power notification there. So again, you'll get a warning 
in the bottom right hand corner of the screen when the battery falls to lower than 25%. So here you can change that. You can set that to whatever you like. So you can make it higher or lower. So if I didn't want it warning me until the battery fell to lower than 5%, I can move that slider bar to the left to five. And then that means once the battery has fallen below 5% or has only got 5% energy left in it, a pop-up will appear in the bottom right hand corner of the screen. Now I wouldn't recommend going as low as that. I think I would I would perhaps set that to 20 or leave it at 25%. It might be that if you're doing something critical and you want it to warn you at a higher percentage, say for instance, you're doing something critical and the battery has got a habit of going down to perhaps less than 50% and then suddenly it just rapidly discharged. Well, you can set that to that percentage like 50% and that gives you a warning. Incidentally, I have been told that the battery icon in Windows 11 isn't that accurate and a Apparently, this is a little bit more accurate. I don't know. I haven't tried it myself. I haven't tested it to that extent. If we go down further, we've got the enable sufficient power notification. Well, what's that? Well, when it's switched on, it will let you know when the battery is charged to a certain percentage. So I know that, again, some people, some Samsung laptops used to have this, where you have this thing called a battery saver. And when you turned it on, it wouldn't charge the battery any higher than 80%. So it could be that you're one of these people that don't like letting their battery charge past a certain point or it could be that you're, you're waiting to use your laptop away from a power source and you just want to get it to a certain percentage to give you enough time to carry on using it on battery. And again, like the uh, notify me when the battery percentage is lower than, you've got a slider bar here and you can change that to whatever you decide. Scrolling down a bit further, you've got the application theme. It's best to leave this on Windows default, but if you want to, you can change it to dark, or if you've already got a dark theme, you can change it to light, but I'm gonna leave mine as the Windows default. It just matches whatever I've got set up on Windows. And you've also got their run at startup. So it basically means when you turn the laptop on, you will get the percentage appear down there in the taskbar for you to easily see. The next option we've got here and the last option is application language. We haven't got too many choices in there. We've got Chinese or English United States. Again, I'd say leave that on system default. So there you go. That's a great little app that shows you all the time on your taskbar how much battery in terms of percentage you've got left. I hope you liked this video and if you did, why not stick around? I've got thousands of other videos covering all sorts of subjects. Hopefully whilst you're here, you're going to find something to educate you, entertain you, amuse you and maybe even save you some time and money.